Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Rome Total War. Um, I'm sorry about the last part, but it looks like I didn't even save that little extra. I'm sorry, I'll have a battle, didn't ever happen. Well, that sucks. Alright, well, let's just not even do that battle on second thought. Instead, let's just end the turn. I like that plan. Start off fresh, and hopefully fresh with no technical difficulties. Yay! That'd be awesome. What? Oh my god, I hate Numidia. I hate Numidia. Damn it. Oh, did I not get to solve the damn Syracuse riding problem either? Oh, great. Okay, um, who's this guy? Yeah, him. Um, some Peltas. Alright, you. You have better command, anyways. Frugal. What? Okay. Um, let's bring these guys over here. People always seem to be pissed on Sicily. What makes them so angry here? I don't know. Oh well. Train. Let's start getting Libyans down here now. Ooh, Temple of Ball. Hell yeah. Okay. Alright, now we have a little bit more troops than before. Hopefully now we'll actually be able to win this time. Hopefully, that is. Um, the campaign's looking promising, so... <clears throat> I've kind of been asking myself how long I want this to go on for. Like, do I want to end it quickly so that I can maybe switch on to a different game? Do I want to draw this out as, like, my first ever Let's Play? I want to enjoy it, whatever. And I'm thinking I'll try to draw it out a little bit, maybe like a medium, happy medium size. But, um, ah, well, I'll just have to wait and see, because I don't really even know what I want to do with this yet. Like, do I want to just beat the Romans and that's that? Or do I want to get to a point where, like, Carthage is the supreme power? Because I can be Rome, and still there can be Egypt, or the Greeks, or Macedon. Britons too, they always seem to do really good for themselves. You know, all those factions could, and Pontus too, there's another one. All of them could potentially um, be powerhouses, and I do I want to get to the point where Carthage is the undisputed power of the ancient world? Well, we'll have to wait and see. Okay. Get to the normal game. Oh. Alright, I got my round shields. Send them to the left. Send my long shields to the right. And then my infantry charging straight at the enemy. And my general just over there. <clears throat> okay. Um, Do I want to start another campaign? I'm just kind of thinking, answering questions. Not uh, Actually, no, I have no questions. I really don't have viewers currently. But um, just thinking about what I want to do give people like a heads up who eventually could be watching this um I could try different games maybe I can even do online play for a couple games I don't know but for the foreseeable future it should just be Rome Total War Carthage campaign Who knows, maybe one day I'll just wake up and decide, I don't feel like playing Rome Total War today. I'm going to play, um, I don't know. I can't, Civilization, who knows. I'm trying to think of games. All the games that was popping in my head weren't even PC games, or I guess they do have PC versions, but not that I own. Yeah, this is kind of the point in the battle in which I was having the um, storage space error last time. Probably won't be having that for a while. I, I gotta keep my eye on that, come to think about it. I don't want that to happen a lot now. Um, ever again, really. Um, I plan to eventually actually get a separate computer just to start doing Let's Plays. Because currently the computer I'm using is actually used for other stuff as well. I, I decide I, I want to do a Let's Play today. And then I did it, and ta-da. I've been working, and... It's so on this computer. Well, you know, I have some nice things like Adobe Premiere set up on here that I can use to edit, add whatever I want to do to the video. 
Um, I still want to get a different computer so that I can have higher graphics card because I want to play Rome 2 right when it comes out. I mean, I don't care what people say, like, oh, you're just using the newer popular game, whatever. No, that game, I'm probably going to, the first experience I'll ever have in that game will probably just be a let's play of it, honestly. Um, I'm saying that, and that's a year down the road. I don't even know if I'm going to keep doing this. Hopefully I will. It seems like a nice little thing. I like doing it so far. Um, but I definitely am excited for that game. Uh, I'm just thinking of other games I could potentially let's play. I, I think I've actually gone through this before. But uh, I think I'll start doing some in Age of Empires 3. I could do online battles. I can just do battles against the AI. I could do the campaign and whatever. There's a lot of different possibilities of things to do in Age of Empires. Man, they're wavering over here. Oh, I hate General's Bodyguard Unit. Well, I'm definitely winning over on this side. But my enemy is winning over on this side. I mean, the battle has basically devolved into two giant screaming mess um, mobs of troops on both sides. Okay, oh, come on, come on, there we go. Crap, um, get them, get them, get them, get their general. Maybe I can get a nice little flanking attack on them. Keep that unit against their camp. Pin down this unit. Their general. Yeah, that should be their... Uh, it's either their faction heir or their faction leader or nothing. <laughs> I don't know what they have at their capital. I don't know. I really don't care, actually. Yay, this time we won. I think that may be part of the fact due to the extra unit of cav and the extra unit of infantry we had this time around. So, about just routing down, guys. Um, that unit routes and ta-da. Continue. What's this unit? Oh, Vilates. Yeah, we can catch him. Oh, you guys can come on. Go, go, go. So, long shield routed and another long shield routed. And Bamilkar now has silver experience as well as one of his round shields. And a very, very nice victory. We still have 900 troops left. Not a full stack. Definitely far from one. I mean, a lot of casualties, actually. But I will take it. Uh, I don't like that. Just get rid of that unit. Anyway. So Capua. Capua is, in my opinion, fairly defenseless. I mean, like, I could probably take it so soon. Oh, yeah. Run off the Julii. Get out the way. Get out the way. Get out the way, bitch. Um, and then here, the people are still pissed. For stupid reasons. Uh, any units I want to just put in here? Maybe the Samnites? Nope. Still not uh, Numidians? Oh, here we go. There we go. Okay. Auto resolve. I don't like that. I think they got too many. inflicted too many casualties on me than I would have liked, but, you know, I always like to just slaughter the enemy in battles. Okay. Well, Armenium. If I was our guys in Armenium, I'd be scared. Oh, Thapsus, that's right. I almost forgot. Sir Gat, what was happening? Uh, more mercenaries? Nope. Okay. Oh, what is there? Pointy. Yes. Two, three units of pointy. Uh, okay. And over here. Nope. Actually, I want round shields and one Iberian. If I have enough time. I don't see the Numidians coming to get me, though. And then I can construct something. You know, I've kind of forgot about that because um, I didn't have money for a while, so I kind of held off construction, focus on the war effort instead. Now that the war effort is pretty much done at this point, 
I mean, the Brudii have lost all possessions in Italy. The Scipii, ever since they lost um, Masana in and Syracuse, have pretty much been nothing. And the Julii and the... Um, I don't know if I mentioned the Julii already. I probably did. But the Julii and the Senate have lost most of any of their strength. At yeah, the Senate, really, it's just done. I think mean, they, they're trying to recruit a little bit. You can see they've recruited these three units now. Why they've onagers, I don't know. Are they planning on actually invading and taking something? Who knows? Oh, this is perfect. Okay. Skippy Hive come out with their army. Is this their faction heir? Let me check. Just a family member. How many guys do they have? They must have some people on the boats. That's stupid. Because that suggests that they have three guys at least. Okay. So they have two units of Cav, two units of Roman Archers, a Hostati, and a Principate unit. I really outclass them in any every department except for missile units is the only thing they have. And missile units, you know, it was a, nice to have the advantage there, but in my opinion, if I were to choose advantage in any wing, I would choose infantry. Because I feel like infantry, if you gain a melee fight with um, enemy Infantry, if you have superiority, you'll win. If you have get a melee fight with enemy missiles, you'll win. I mean, they'll eventually run out of missiles, right? Then if you have pikemen, that's a type of infantry unit, you can beat Cav. Ta-da! Infantry is the greatest. They're, they're better for defensive strategy, too, which is kind of something I like to do sometimes. Anyways, why don't I start deployment? Not sure. He didn't really have much of a speech now, did he? Oh, oh, we're fighting here again? Nice. Okay, let's just line up my cav behind. Yeah, let's have, like, him join their unit. Alright, Bamlikar. 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 That's a, f that's a funny pronunciation of the name. Um, Bamlikar. Siberians, and then Samnites. I believe there's Samnite Gladiators, our type of unit in the game, if I remember correctly. Oh, uh, forgot we were on high speed, fast forward. Oh, come on, come on, there we go. They're not smart. Uh, the battle AI in... Vanilla and the Diplomacy AI, in my opinion, too, are never that smart. All right, let's just crash right into their study. They're already going to lose some morale because they're watching their their allies, their friends route. Oh, and they weren't even that organized. Nice. Hold. Who is this? Yeah, him. You just go over there. Take get, yeah, take care of the archers. That's what I'm trying to say. Their general re withdrew. Man, that's stupid. Because they're basically ensuring their Hasadi are getting crushed now. Oh, well, this looks like it will be a very, very easy, clean victory for, for me. The Romans kind of advanced piecemeal. And while, you know, I kind of did too with my two caveats that just kind of charged out ahead, they didn't really act on that. I mean, they were. It seemed like they may have with that one general's bodyguard unit that kind of got out ahead. Um, Prince Pays. Oh, come on. He's going to get away. Don't let him go. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I'm continuing, man. I'm going to kill all you. Okay. Um, get over there. Crap. Oh, man. The general got away. That sucks. Come on. I, didn't I click attack? Or... Oh, well. Oh, who's that? Is there some unit left still? Oh, there they are. Oh, well, 13 Roman archers getting away, not a big deal. 
Yay. You'll have crap.